Hi everyone. Uh, one of the biggest issues that I see in the gym uh, is when people will join and they'll be super excited about reaching their goals, but they eventually fall off because they feel like they've not had any direction, uh, nowhere to go. They'll jump on a treadmill and then kind of feel uh, like they're not moving in the direction they wanted to. They're not seeing as much progress as they wanted. Well, uh, now Anytime Fitness Corporate has just rolled out this really cool new tool that we can use uh, to help everybody kind of get started and have an idea as to what direction to move into. And it is the Anytime Fitness app. And it comes with two different apps, this app and the workout app. So I'm gonna show you really quick how to download them and how to uh, log into them using your key fob number or your cell phone number. Uh, and then we'll kind of go through a quick tutorial about how to use them and all the cool features that are involved in them. So you're gonna wanna go to your app store. On the iPhone, it looks uh, like this. So it's this little blue icon. You're gonna click on it. You're gonna wanna type up here in the search bar, Anytime Fitness. And then for most of us in the, in the app store, you're gonna see Anytime Fitness right here and then Anytime Workouts underneath. Go ahead and download both of those guys. It should take just a second for them to download. They're popping up on the screen now. You're going to want uh, both the one with the running man on it and the one with the dumbbell on it. Uh, these are both going to be apps that are really useful to you as a member. So once you have these apps downloaded, click on this guy. Um, since you're a member, you go ahead and click find or go ahead and click members. And then you're going to want to create an account. You'll put your first name in like we have it in the system. So John Doe, whatever your email is. Uh, and then you're going to create your own password. Then you retype that password there. And on the following screen, it's going to have you either put in your cell phone number or your key fob number. Now, either you have a square key fob or one of the older gray round key fobs. Uh, on the side of it, there should be a number with some letters, uh, and it'll have you type that number in. If you have one of those key fobs where you've accidentally worn the numbers off, or your cell phone is for some reason not working, feel free to just give me a quick call and I can text you your key fob number, because I have it all in my system. So if you're trying to log in and you're having issues, please just let me know because these are super cool apps. Uh, but let me show you really quick what it looks like once you're logged in. So once you've logged into this app, you can actually uh, go in here and it's, it, it has a lot of really cool features. So one of the cool things that it does is it actually links up with uh, Map My Fitness up here on the left side and My Fitness Pal over here on the right. So you can actually track your activity and track your food um, and it'll sync up with this app and kind of tell you how you've done. It'll also show you your gym visits in the month. So for this month, I have three. Being that there's only two days in this month, that's doing pretty well. Um, and it also shows me how many I did in April and in May. Another really cool thing is you can actually look at your agreement information. It's right here on the more page at the bottom right and then agreement info in the center. Uh, you can check out your agreement, uh, what your monthly dues are, go to find out whatever gym you're located at, you can change your contact info, and you can change your payment method from wherever you are. So it gives you a lot of freedom with the app, uh, with your own agreement. So that's really cool. It also syncs up with a workouts app. But I had you download this guy with the, uh, the dumbbell on him. He's super cool. Um, so whenever you're going to this guy, what I'd recommend is going to plans right here if you're if you're new to this guy. Um, you can kind of choose whatever fitness level you are. So say you're, you're, you're new to the gym, you're a beginner, and then uh, let's try uh, weight loss. We're wanting to lose a little weight on the front end. We've got a full gym available to us, and it's going to give you all the different workouts that match your ability level and your goal. So if we're trying to just do uh, weight loss level one right here at the bottom, it gives you several weeks of workouts to go through so you can do day one day two day three it shows you how much time they are if there's something within this workout that you're not familiar with you can click on it and then it's going to give you a quick video of how to actually stand up right with one foot on a bench and the other foot on the floor with your hands at your sides rapidly change feet. so that's really cool um, it gives you all the different workouts you can do another cool feature that you have is right here on the left side with the menu. You can go to um, 
workouts right here, this tab that's highlighted, and you can choose just based on your goals. So say you're a, a bro and you're in here and you want to bodybuild, and you're wanting to hit a lot of arms. So this is all the arm workouts you can do, a lot of split routines here. If you just want to do a mass builder, you can do that. Let's just go ahead and click all. So if we want to just do overall bodybuilding, let's do bodybuilding level one. It gives you eight weeks of workouts. So this is an eight week program you can do. You started doing three workouts a week and gradually moved to four. So let's just check out day one. Notice that you actually burn 437 calories in this workout. That's pretty great. That's as much as a normal cardio workout just doing strength building. But so uh, say you're in here and you don't know how to use one. Remember I showed you last time you can press it and then it'll give you a quick video of how to do it. Sit holding the handles. So that's cool. Um, also, if you kind of like to uh, do your own thing in here and you're just like, okay, I want to have a shoulder day. Uh, one of the things you can do is go to the builder here and you can actually choose a body part and it'll give you all the workouts for that. So say you wanted to just work your forearms. That's a really hard one to find exercises for. It gives you every exercise we have on the book for forearms or back. It gives you every single back exercise and you can choose through any of these guys and they show you a tutorial video so it's really handy so I really recommend using these apps they're gonna give you a lot of direction um, and they're gonna keep those of you who just don't have a plan when you come in here they're gonna make sure that you do have something and they're gonna make sure that you see results and if you have any other questions about it please let me know I'd love to help you out with it Hey guys, um, my name is Emily. I'm the member experience manager here. And now that Tim's kind of told you how the app works, I just kind of wanted to hop in and let you know um, that one of the options in our training department is actually virtual training through the app. So what this means is that every week you'll get brand new workouts that are customized by a coach. You get access to that co coach if you ever have questions. Um, every four weeks you'll get an assessment and a check-in with the coach just to make sure you're seeing the goals that you want. Um, you also get nutrition coaching along with that. So if y'all are interested in that, why don't you just comment below and let us know. And I hope you guys have a good day.